Hi, and welcome to Utopia MMIP. In this episode, I'm going to be doing a brief preview and score prediction for our visit to Prenton Park, where we play Tranmere Rovers on Saturday. Let's get cracking. Tranmere's form is identical to Don's, with four wins, including an impressive 4-2 victory against Notts County and a 5-1 de demolition of Salford City. But like Dons, they couldn't keep their run going when they lost their last game 1-0 to Barrow. A match their manager was serving a touchline ban for, which may have impacted the result. Tranny have scored 13 goals in their last five games, but have only kept one clean sheet. Obviously Dons only scored eight in their last five games, but they have managed to keep an impressive three clean sheets in five before deciding to give Doncaster a three-goal head start when they eventually decided to start playing. Historically, the Dons have had the better of Tranmere, winning 11 of, their pr of the previous 20 games played at the, by the clubs. Although, the win at the Moo Camp in August was the first win in six games for the Dons. And most who were at the game in August would probably agree that Dons were very lucky to get that win, with Tranmere shooting twice as many times and getting nearly four times the number of corners in the game. Dons form over the Christmas period has been very good, except for gifting Doncaster three points on New Year's Day. So I hope the team recover quickly from the defeat in South Yorkshire. The lineup is likely to be different than over the last five games because of Kemp's return from a good loan period at Swindon, which I hope gets him put, putting in better performances than we've seen from him as in a Don shirt so far. And of course, the long rumoured arrival of, and I hope I'm saying this right, Stephen Warren, who arrives from Mike Williamson's previous club, Gateshead. With the two of them combined, either scoring or creating over 40 goals so far this season, they could prove vital to our efforts in getting to the playoffs. Tranmere's Connor Jennings is their top scorer. With nine goals, he also has five assists, so he will probably be the man to watch for our defence. He also scored the winner last time we played at Tranmere in League Two. For Dons, our Lord and Saviour, Obviously, it's Max Dean. He is the top scorer with eight goals. And on the assist front, Alex Gilby is leading the way with five. Tranmere are currently 16 and the Dons are eighth. But there is only six points separating the sides. And obviously, this wouldn't be a prediction video without a prediction. I think I'm going to go 3-1, Max Dean getting his first hat-trick for the club. That's the Tranmere preview all done. It will be our second visit to Preston Park, where last time we were lucky enough to be invited to sit in the away dugout to watch the players warm up. But that's where the hospitality ended as we lost 2-1. Thanks for watching. Remember, smash that like button. Subscribe if you haven't already. And as always, come on you dons!